please like this video leave a comment and don't forget to share all right welcome to scanning tv on youtube once again let's pick the latest news coming in from the camp of black stars now black stars defender jonathan Manson has reacted to six new players who have joined the black stars of ghana ahead of the workout 2022 and also questions on some players who played the qualifiers and won't make it to the World Cup and players that are also coming in to take out others he talked about that we look at it here on this channel then we will talk about former black stars midfielder emmanuel ajimabedu he has also spoken on black stars going into the World Cup and the new players coming in we look at it here on this channel before you dive into it if you haven't subscribed yet don't forget to smash on that subscribe button put on the post notification bell on all for more updates here on this channel this video is also sponsored by intercorp yes so intercorp is a company which is based in spain and they deals with exports so if you are in ghana here and you want to import anything or wherever you are watching me from all over the world just contact intercorp the numbers are below there just pick the number chat them they are going to sort you out help you import any goods that you want be it car television quality one with affordable prices they will help you out so just check out intercorp okay so let's delve into it and begin from jonathan mensa now jonathan mensa is a black stars defender who plays in united states of america and um, he reacted to the six players who have joined the black stars of ghana talking of Tarek lamte who plays for brighton and hope albion inaki williams of atletico bilbao german trial that is stefan ambrosios ransford konizdofa patrick pfeiffer have all joined the black stars of ghana and saddam team's defender Mohamed salisu he only needed to accept to join ghana and he has also done so now according to him he said this when he was having an interview that he was asked on the six new players who have joined the black stars of ghana and he said this he said it is always good for the country but honestly me as a player i don't have any problem with that but i would have my opinion sometimes you put things into perspective and all that people outside will raise concerns about their non-participation in qualifiers he said as quoted by football ghana now he continued to say that sometimes it happens that way some come and play qualifiers and do not play in a tournament proper for some reasons but you know i'm not a coach nor a management member he finally said this he said as a player i just have focus on doing my best for my club and if i'm called into the national team squad i will go and help the team and it is good that they are choosing to play for ghana so he said it is good for them to choose ghana and also yes it's normal that some players who play qualifiers and won't make it to the tournament proper and some other players will also come in late and make it to the tournament but he's not a coach nor a management member now let's turn our attention to Emmanuel Ajman Bedou. yes this player has played the black stars of Ghana he was one of the best midfielders at his peak and he has also talked about the black stars going into the World Cup and the impact that they are going to make in there now Emmanuel Ajman Bedou, also having an interview he was also asked on the players join the black stars of ghana and all and according to him he thinks that it is good for ghana to beef their squad so um when he was speaking these were his actual words he said truth be told we have quality in the black stars but we have to also beef up the team we have to bring some players on board and that is a fact we need to beef the team because we are going to the highest stage in world football which is the World Cup. That is what he said when he was having an interview. So according to him, he thinks that despite Ghana having a good squad, yes, Ghana must still improve the squad going into the World Cup because the Mundial itself is the highest stage of world football. Now, he also admitted that Ghana has quality players and therefore Ghana must go in there and do what with the new additions coming in to join the black stars of ghana so guys let me know what you think about these two news one emmanuel Jumabedu saying that ghana must beef up the squad ahead of the world cup and he's expecting more from the team and jonathan mensa also saying that the six new players is good for them to join the black stars of ghana smash on that subscribe button put on the bell for more updates here on this channel this was Kenny tv and of course we shall meet later subscribe to the channel and hit on the notification bell for more